Hi, this is Steve Caldwell, and today we're going to demonstrate the unpacking of your new bone box. After removing from the shipping packaging, the bone box inner box is going to look like this. The artwork on the outside of the box is actually going to mimic the actual connectors that are on the box inside itself. The bone box itself will be in a plastic bag inside of the box. Also within the box will be a micro USB cable that you can use for powering your bone box. The cable is a robust rugged cable with an angled connector and a micro USB connector seats firmly into the bone box. Remove your bone box from the inner bag. On one side of the bone box are the Ethernet connections, the buttons, and also the USB power connection. The other side of the box has the USB host connection as well as the MIDI DIN in and out connections. The bottom of the box has the serial number of the bone box. Please do not remove the sticker from the box as you will need this serial number in order to gain access to your bone box. We also include this nice little sticker that you can display prominently anywhere you choose. Finally, there's this nice little booklet with a set of instructions for everything you need in order to get your bone box up and running. The booklet is also available for download at the BOEM website. To get started, first you need to apply power to your bone box. You can use the supplied micro USB cable. You will need to attach it to a USB adapter with the right power supplied by your country. When you plug in the power, the power light will blink until the bone box is completely started up, at which point the power light will go solid. Please proceed to the next tutorial for initial bone box setup. Thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, feel free to reach us at www.bome.com.